the good thing about not being a Californication is, or California, anybody who thinks California is the land of dreams is seriously mistaken. This is beautiful. And of course, this is, well, we're just out here. We're in Utah. But I get in my car, pull into the gas station. I'm cranking rat. I'm cranking the third album, I think it is. You know, dancing, uh, whatever, dancing something. <laughs> Shows you how big a rat fan I am. But I'm just cranking that album, and everybody, you know, there's two guys in his muddy truck pull up. They're like, yeah, yeah. This freaking uh, Oriental or Asian dude on a Harley pulls up. All right, man. And then this white dude with a beard and a shaved head, he pulls up, and he's cranking this friggin' rap crap. And I like good rap, like the original N.W.A. and Snoop, and that's about it. I'm done. But I have rat cranking. Rat, not rap. And he hears it, and he's looking at me, and he's like, oh, I'm putting his head, his head goes down. And I'm like, dude, come on, man. So he comes back into his truck, lights a cigarette, He's looking at me, and he's, you know, shaking his head, and I'm like, yeah. Metal, dude. At least pop metal. You know, and it's acceptable up here because people actually think. And sure, they're 10, 20 years behind the times, but that's kind of nice. It's endearing. It's, just, it's so good because if I'm cranking, you know, rat in Burbank or anywhere else in California except for maybe the high deserts, not even there, Victorville and, and Palmdale, that's just South Central, it's moved out there, so, nah. It used to be, you could, it was cool, but now, nah. you gotta go out, Nevada, Utah, Arizona, and then metal is cool still. I forget about that, man. I'm forgetting that California sucks. And I've been trying to write this album in California. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to cut as many demos as I can up here. Where I got the spirit of metal. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just good, man. It's good to see people liking good music instead of the crap. All I hear around where I live is camel disco. And that's what Armenians play. And I told them, dude, what is that? Camel disco? Oh, no, that's the music of our country. I go, with a disco beat? Boom, 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 boom. Sure, I sound racist, but hey, so what? I'm not. Does that guy look racist to you? Probably with the shaved head, but I'm not. <laughs> Just it makes you feel good when people like good music. Wow, they opened that road up. I haven't noticed that. I only come up here a couple times, like this far up, like two or three times a year. This is past where I usually go. But uh, so there you go. That was nice. So this is day two and a half kind of of my trip and man does it feel good to be that crap out of Cala friggin fornia I hate it there there's no reason to be there it's too expensive and the people suck ass the end and most of my family lives there so except for them and when I'm there everybody else sucks all right I'm done Later, man. Metal is, see, still alive. Or hard rock, whatever, hard rock. Hard rock, heavy metal. It's all good to me, brother. All right, late. Now put on something good, man. Put on some old Motley Crue or friggin' a rat. Put some good old, uh, good 80s. Motley Crue, rat. 
lost the first one, maybe two albums, and you're pretty much running out right there. There's not many. Oh, Guns N' Roses, just Appetite for Destruction, that's it. Everything else, not very happy with. And then, nothing good came out of L.A. Oh, my band, Fatal Attraction, which I have listened to. It's, it's in the uh, stack of, I'm actually listening to CDs. No, uh, I haven't taken out my MP3 device yet. But, uh, man, it's good to see people like good music. And what a beautiful country. This is. On the coast, on the left coast and the right coast, they're evil, they suck, and they're disturbed. In the middle, it's okay. I mean, California sucks and is going to drop off into the ocean, I hope, when I'm not there, or my parents, or my sister. But everybody else, start swimming. And New York and everybody on the bright coast, just leave. Go back. Just start swimming to whatever continent you land on. Boy, that sounds bad and racist, huh? I'm sorry. It's, there's no race about it. There's no race about it. It's a way of thinking that I don't like. And it's not Republican or Democrat because they're both the same. They both have become suck. I like a Reagan Republican and a Charlton Heston Republican. This is going to piss people off. Because they were actually Democrats. They flipped in the 60s when they realized everything was turning. If Kennedy, John Kennedy, was running now, he'd be considered a Republican. Believe me. So, you know, and if they want to make that argument, well, Clinton, and Clinton was a, a, a smooth-talking son of a gun. He scared the crap out of me, though. And Obama was just horrifying. But I shut my mouth because a lot of ignorant people voted for him twice. And I said, let them, you know, they made their bed laying it. Now let us lay in this bed for the other people that voted for you know who. Can't even say his name. Trump. For the people who voted for that guy, let them and write it out. Let's see if he does a better job. Let's see if he doesn't give billions of dollars of, of, of gold and money, cash, to the enemy, Iran, and uranium from the Clinton's uranium mine. Pure uranium, you know, weapon-grade uranium. So... Yeah, that's what Obama did. And then he took out, what, three trillion over a Christmas break and threw it into his Obamacare to get that going, which it never did. It never did. I was on disability. I know. It never existed. Obamacare never existed. They kept saying, well, it's getting ready to. Well, it's gonna, well, we'll put you on the beginning. They never, and it's already... Three trillion, he just threw three, three trillion away into that. He gives billions to Iran. It's, okay, I'm not gonna get it. So it was good to see people getting into rat. And that's all I'm gonna do is listen to some metal and other stuff. Right? Later.